Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Dagger Ratchet and welcome to my second video of the best class setup. In this series I'm gonna be giving you guys the best setups you can do or use with each and every weapon in Call of Duty Ghost so that you can achieve maximum success with it. Right now we're gonna be covering the Maverick DLC weapon which came with the Onslaught DLC map pack. So this weapon is pr a pretty mediocre fire uh, assault rifle, probably better than half the assault rifles in the category, but not as good as the Honey Badger or the AK-12. So we're going to be starting with the attachments right away. We have gone for grip because this weapon has quite a bit of recoil, and when you go in those long range gunfights, your gun usually kicks up, so that control that you can stay accurate, and you have probably a better chance of winning the gunfight with grip. Next we've gone for silencer because we can stay off the radar. In free for all it's essential that you stay off the radar and silencer is probably one of the best attachments you can get on your weapon to be very good in free for all and win almost every game. For my perks I've gone with ready up to bring up a gun faster after sprinting. In free for all you come around the corner while sprinting and, and if, you, if you're not able to bring up your gun as fast as you can then you wouldn't be able to win the gunfight. Next we have sca uh, sleight of hand in many situations in FIFA and many other game modes uh, we have to reload really fast and um, so sleight of hand helps us to do that and to get out of the sticky situations where you might get killed reloading which is pretty annoying and that's why I choose sleight of hand on almost every one of my classes. Then we have Stalker. Stalker is probably one of the most essential perks in an assault rifle because you, you, you can stray faster so that allows you to go around corners aiming down sights you don't waste time trying to aim down sights the problem with assault rifle is compared to SMGs and shotguns is that they aim down sight really slow um, so you if you are aiming down sights and moving faster around the corners you have a lesser chance of losing the gunfight um, then we have dead silence so that we can minimize the sound of our footsteps so that no one else can sound hold us um, it's really essential in free for all as it's a really quiet game mode and people usually listen for footsteps so with dead silence you basically have no sound while walking around and running around which is pretty essential um, in free for all then we have focus focus probably one of the perks I put on every single one of my classes and almost everyone does that is because when you're getting shot your gun usually kicks up really high and your view goes out of the scene so that's basically the problem when you get shot at so focus reduces the flinch when you get shot at so that you don't actually kick up so much and you can stay on target even when you're getting shot at there are many many situations in this game where you uh, you get shot at and you almost and you die just because you're, you're taking bullets and and you can't get on target and turn on the guy so focus helps in turning on people really well um, then we have the specialist strike package because in my opinion the streaks and ghosts are not great as compared to black ops 2 and black ops 1 black ops 2 had amazing streaks they would do work they would get like 15 20 kills each time you call one set and you can get 100 pluses like a boss but in ghost that's not the case unfortunately i have tried out the assault streaks the helo pilot and the thing they're pretty good you can get quite a bit of kills but not as good as black ops 2 in my opinion running around getting kills getting perks making you yourself a super soldier is much better than getting uh, sitting in a streak and killing people so we've gone with the specialist strike package at three points we have scavengers so we don't run, of, run out of ammo we have amplifiers so we can hear enemy footsteps louder even if you have a decent headset disconnected to the back of your tv using an adapter you can really hear footsteps in this game the sound is done really really well so it really gives you an advantage to know where the enemies come from before they see you for next we have deadeye deadeye is probably one of the most the best perks in call of duty it's a five point perk that's the reason I don't keep it in my primary perks uh, keep it as a specialist perk it increases your damage each shot you get and on every one of my specialist classes I have Deadeye and it really helps out not only to conserve ammo but to kill to drop people like really fast and with the Maverick since the damage is pretty high it's like the Remington you can drop people extremely fast um, then for my specialist perks we have quick draw resilience hardline and on the go I think it's on the go or, or agility I'm not sure agility yeah so quick toss that we can bring up a gun faster while aiming um, 
so you don't have to aim down sights all the time when you go around corners and resilience so that we don't fall uh, and take a lot of falling damage off a cliff to kill someone and agility so we can move faster and hard lines so that we can get our KEMs faster which is the primary reason we are going for um, going for the specialist loadout so that's it guys for this video I hope you guys did enjoy uh, my second best class setup video I have a screenshot of the screen right now so I'll see you guys in my next video I'm up peace